What's going on YouTube? It is your boy Brandon Ortega coming at you guys with a brand new video and it feels weird to kind of slow that down. I usually normally say it fast, but I just wanted to slow it down a little bit. Today we're going to be talking about something that I get asked about a lot and it's about my clutch. Now, if you guys do not know, I am running E85. I do have a tune from Daniel Butler, uh, the man himself who works with Hondata uh, on a parametrics tune. So just to give you guys a little backstory on this tune. It is 247 horsepower and around 305 torque. I believe that number is pretty accurate, considering that it was, you know, tested and it was on a dyno tune. And I do live in the city where it was at, so like numbers are pretty much identical. I haven't put this car in an actual dyno yet because yes, I am scared for the clutch. Now a lot of people ask me, is the clutch holding? Does it slip? Is yeah, that this, that, the whole nine yards? Yes, it does slip. This is my second car in which I've owned. Obviously, that is an SI. I had the coupe before, and then I have this now but this is the first one i put e85 on and the power is great like having that power there is amazing but the only thing that sucks is when i'm actually trying to get on it so when i'm like let's just say i'm cruising not even cruising let's say when i'm in three four thousand rpms um just kind of going about my business and you know i downshift maybe to fourth gear get it up a little bit and then i start to go the clutch does slip i know the clutches in these cars are like the absolute worst ever I mean, if you guys own a 10 gen, you guys are trying to get power out of it. You guys know that the clutches are absolutely garbage. Like they're, they're, they're really bad. They don't hold any power. Even on my coupe, when I had the plus nine PSI with the intake math, that would slip. So there's no doubt that this is going to slip as well. I kind of knew that coming into it, but I kind of wanted to see how far I can push it. And I think, I think it's on his last leg right now. So I am going to be down, uh, down tuning it a little bit just to kind of save the clutch a little bit. But I kind of wanted to talk about the thing that I want to get, the clutch that I want to get and everything else. So a lot of people also ask me, well, why don't you get, you know, the action clutch or clutch masters that's out right now? Why don't you go for them and you know I, I get asked that a lot i do get asked that a lot and I've, I've i've heard a couple bad things about them i'm not gonna say what they are what it is i heard it's a 50 50 with clutch masters or action clutch i heard it's 50 50 whether you get a good one or not the brand that i'm looking for is act which is advanced clutch technologies the reason why i want to go with them is because i've only heard good things about them i see other youtubers use them like dustin williams on his evo use them but the only thing is they've been out of stock since i've been looking at them i'm trying to contact them but when i did they're closed so that's kind of my mistake i do want to get the action clutch uh clutch now i do want to get the organic flywheel uh, so it doesn't feel like a full race car because i do not want a lot of clutch chatter which i read on the forums is minimal with the action clutch uh the street one and it can hold up to 360 torque which is way more than i'm going to be pushing out of this car very soon so i feel like i really won't even need that and i'm sorry for the wind if the wind's even coming um but I just wanted to come out here and kind of take a quick little thumbnail. So I read online that this the ACT clutch is supposed to be dropping really, really soon. I don't know how soon it's supposed to be dropping. I just read it's supposed to be coming soon. But if you do go on the website, everything is up. It just says out of stock, which it kind of sucks because I don't think I don't know anyone who is running that clutch right now who you know is doing anything. So maybe I can get a sponsorship. So ACT, if you're seeing this, what's up? Maybe we can work something out. You guys are not too far from me, so maybe we can you know get a 10 gen thing going. I am gonna be getting the street edition if anything. I'm just waiting for it to go on sale. Like I said, action clutch is I heard is a 50 50 clutch masters. Haven't heard anyone running it, and everyone's kind of getting the type R retrofit. Personally, I'm not gonna spend two thousand dollars on the uh, clutch. That's just that's a little out of you know pocket for me. I know it's literally gonna save you money in the end you know in the long run but i just feel like 2000s right now is not what i want to spend on a clutch for this car i know it holds the power i mean obviously the type r is pushing like 300 but i just i don't want to push that you know i i have dr driven one felt really good but like i said just that two thousand dollar mark i really don't want to pay two thousand dollars for a clutch i just don't feel like that's the right price but personally like i said act is the best one that looks like for me it's about a thousand dollars with the flywheel so everything is included obviously not going to install it myself don't know how to do that kind of don't really want to mess anything up when it comes to a clutch but i mean for the most part this car does slip especially around the 3000 4000 rpm mark it's not the best there i haven't really felt the full power in this car the car is a little bit dirty it's been like really ugly weather here in la but um yeah, I just, I don't know. I, I'm really scared because I feel like this clutch is getting ready to fall. You know, yesterday I did a pull and it was kind of like a little herky-jerky. And then when I let off of it, it was like smelling like clutch. So I was like, mm, maybe I should down tune this car. So I think I might be getting off E85 until I can get a clutch or until ACT releases it. Maybe we can work something out. But yeah, I don't know. I just, I don't want to get a clutch that's 50-50 and I put it in and I absolutely, it's just the worst. I don't, I don't want to go through any of that. And I don't want to have any problems of that sort. I just feel like that's that's 
if you're just burning money that way, the Type R Retrofit, don't want to spend two grand on, on it. So I feel like ACT might be the best route for me. It is $1,000 for everything. So I feel like I'll be okay, in my honest. But I'm going to show you guys some clips of this car straight slipping because it does slip pretty hard. So I'm going to go ahead and get down to the roads and uh, let, let, me, let me show you guys some slipping. This clutch really does slip. Uh, you know, obviously I was in low RPM trying to gas it, but I mean, still, I still have that slipping problems. Even on the freeway, it's a lot worse, so I'll take you guys there right now. So yeah, the clutch is obviously slipping. I feel like it's gonna fall pretty soon. I am a little bit scared, I'm not gonna lie. I am scared to drive this thing because I just don't know what's gonna happen. But uh, for the most part, if you guys can, you know, I, I know what clutch I want to get, but if you guys can convince me to maybe get another clutch, uh, maybe I'll give it a try. But like I said, I just want, I don't know, I just heard bad, not bad thing, but I heard it's like a 50-50 whether I get action clutch or not. But uh, if you guys know, you know, if you guys are like, hey, you should do it, I get enough people to say that. I would just probably do it, but for the most part, I think I'm going to get ACT Advanced Clutch Technologies. I just feel like they're more reputable, but could be just me, but I don't know yet. Um, but yeah, anyways, I'm going to end the video here. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. I know it's something really short, but I just wanted to give you guys a little update on the car. I do have a vlog coming out soon, probably next week. Uh, but yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Give this video a thumbs up. Subscribe if you guys have, have not already. I'll see you guys next time. Dev, peace. I know why they ain't know me, so I switch. Bye.